Good morning, hello there, and welcome. Thank you for tuning in. This is Justin Mott, and now it's time for your local and area news. Top news story this morning, speed limits will be changing in Tenaha. They're scheduled to be lowered. The speed limit on FM 2695 will be lowered to 45 miles per hour from 55 miles per hour from FM 947 to loop 157. There's also going to be a new school zone installed, and the speed limit will be 25 miles per hour in the school zone when the lights are flashing. When lights are not flashing, it will be 45 miles per hour in either direction. And now moving along, it's time for your Monday morning fire report with Center Fire Chief Keith Bindum. Good morning, this is Keith with the City of Center Fire Department for your weekly fire report. We have a total of 11 calls for the week of July 22nd through the 27th. That's a total of 11 calls. Week of July 22nd through the 27th, we had one house fire, eight grass fires. One reg and one hazmat steel. Also, I want to remind everyone that the burn ban is in effect. The burn ban is in effect. No burn, no burning uh, to further notice. And I hope everyone have a great day. Thank you. And now moving along in your rest report this morning in Shelby County, Michael Atticuson, age 45, of Joaquin, impersonating a public servant. Melvin Cheris, age 24, of Silsby, failure to appear, original charge, possession of a controlled substance. Ashley Phillips, age 29, of Timpson, endangering a child. David Lewis, age 38, of Timpson, endangering a child. Charles Rayleigh, age 37, of Center, parole violation. Dennis Bruchard, age 34, of Nacogdoches, theft. Brandon Stansberry, age 35, a sinner, driving while intoxicated in possession of marijuana. Adam Pleasant, age 33, a sinner, possession of a controlled substance. Undies Carpenter, age 24, of Mount Enterprise, public intoxication, unlawful carrying of a weapon, and resisting arrest. In your arrest report this morning in St. Augustine County, Tina Jo Mullins, possession of a controlled substance, failure to identify, and warrant for failure to identify. Todd Brandon Newman, parole warrant and driving while intoxicated, third charge or more. La Bravian Javante Thomas, theft for burglary of a building. Matthew Edwards Williams, intoxicated manslaughter, two counts. And now, moving along in your obituaries this morning, Mr. Willie Swindle Syrup Man, age 103 of the New Harmony community, passed away on Thursday evening at Pine Grove Nursing Center. Visitation will be held today from 9 a.m. to 11 a.m. at the Community Funeral Home in Center, Texas. Services will be held today at 11 a.m. at the Community Funeral Home Chapel in Center. Interment will follow at the Bennett Chapel Cemetery in Shelbyville, Texas. He is survived by four sons, four daughters, and a host of other family and friends. For local video news, check out our website at cbc-radio.com. That's cbc-radio.com. We are your local and area video news source. And with your news this morning, this has been Justin Mott encouraging you to go out and be amazing. CBC-radio.com, keeping you connected wherever you go.